Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Today I am going to be um I'm going to be sharing something I found a few days ago. Um if you've played Pandemic Express then you've probably heard of Bar Golden Boys or the Snow Easter Egg. And if you haven't then don't worry because um I'll be explaining that uh, later. You know what? I'll just start explaining. Um okay. So Bar Golden Boys is a uh, a location on the map that can be found in the stations. Every station has a map with the words Bar Golden Boys. Okay, so what you need to do is go to this area on the map, take the radio with you um, that spawns in the station, and go um, underwater. Okay, so F4, F4 is in the ocean, but don't worry. Uh, just take the radio, go underwater, and you will find the Bar Golden Boys, as you see here. Now, once you're here, um, you're going to want to press E on it to activate the machine and get out of here. So after you activate the machine, you are going to head to Mills, or you're going to go right underneath Mills, which is top right of D4. Now what the um, what the machine at Bar Golden Boys does is it opens a gate that is in hidden in the hills at uh, D4. So once you go to D4, uh, where I am right now, uh, you'll see that there is an opening in the wall. So basically what the Bar Golden Boys thing did was it opened uh, one of the gates here. So if you keep going forward, you will need a radio and a zombie. So the zombie just keeps following you, and eventually you'll get to the zombie lever that um, is labeled Zombie Boy, and the zombie boy has to hit that one. And after the zombie hits his lever, you'll need to hit yours one more time, and then you can finally get into the Easter Egg room. Now, once you're in the Easter Egg room, you will notice um, some uh, strange things. So once you're in, uh, you'll first notice uh, pillars around the map, or pi pillars around the room. Um, you'll notice some bumps on the ground, and a well. Okay, this well is important um, for what I'm going to be showing you. So, keep walking around the room, um, go to the next one, and you see light bulbs, you see water, and um, you see like three openings, right? Three rooms to go through and on the right uh, you can actually um, find a health station but this machine doesn't heal you okay so what this what this health station does is if you hit it or punch it it will start snowing around the map okay so the machine activates the snow and you can go into the rooms um, the one in the middle is just a tiny room it has nothing in it the one on the right um, has a chair and a giant light bulb that will come in handy later and on the left is the exit. Now, um, now that I've showed you this and um, told you the steps of how to get here, I am going to be showing you um, something that is uh, a bit mind-blowing. So, um, let me tell you uh, first how I found it. So, a few weeks ago on November 13, the head developer, uh, Bix, posted on Twitter. Um, let me just read what he said. So, this is his tweet. We did a very long research in Pandemic Express to get the lighting close to Simon Stalinhag into the feeling of Stalker by Andrei, by Andrei Tarkovsky. Um, not sure if I'm saying that right. Um, but anyway, um, I didn't think much of this. I just uh, I looked it up. I saw that Simon Stalinhag was just an artist and that Stalker was just a uh, movie. So um, I saw that um, some of the some of uh, Simon Stalinhag's paintings. Um, do look like the uh, kind of that feeling that you get when you're playing Pandemic Express. So I didn't. Um, I, I thought that they just used uh, those things as inspiration. But um, I went back to the Snow Easter Egg and I looked at the numbers on top, uh, the numbers that have been bugging me for about four months now. Um, I've I've been trying to figure out what these numbers meant, and after a while I forgot about them. I forgot they were a thing, and I went back to the snowy string and I, I saw the numbers again. I saw the numbers and I wanted to do something with them again. So that's when I looked it up. I found uh, Stalker. Stalker was the top result, uh, as you can see here. And so I clicked on Stalker and I remembered uh, back to uh, Dimitri's tweet. I remembered that he had posted something about Stalker and um, I started doing research and I started looking into it. Um, it was actually my friend uh, Doomsooth who was uh, my friend Doomsooth was actually reading a lot of the plot of the movie, 
and finding out a lot of um, a lot of similarities of the the movie Soccer and the game Pandemic Express. Anyway, um, let me show you some of the scenes. So first, when they walk in, they see the well, right? They see bumps of sand. They see pillars. They keep walking, and what do they see? <laughs> they see light bulbs. They see light bulbs. They see water, and it's just. It, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. Man. I um, I was happy when I saw this. I was uh, mind blown. Anyway, they keep going, and they get to the small room. The small room I was talking about. The the room with the the lamp. Look at this. Look at look at how similar they are. Look at the similarities. There's a chair, the light bulb. It's it's crazy what the uh, developers did with this. Okay, so um, now that you've seen that. Uh, the room from Pandemic Express was um, actually from the Stalker movie. Let me give you a bit of information on Stalker. So the reason they went to so in Stalk, in the movie Stalker, um, the reason that they went here is because um, there was a this is a room right on the far right where they look at, where they're looking at right now. That's a room that grants wishes. Okay, and in Pandemic, uh, the room is apparently locked and you can't get to it. And I am trying to figure out a way uh, to maybe crack a code and be able to get in. Or if... I don't know if the easter egg is over yet. Anyway, um, I just wanted to explain to you some similarities from uh, soccer. In soccer, there is an area called the zone. Now, the zone is guarded by uh, government, by government facility and... Uh, security guards. They don't let any humans in because there are remnants and um, it's basically just a fallout uh, abandoned uh, area. There's remnants in the zone that uh, apparently have extraterrestrial activity and uh, basically anything in the zone uh, defy the laws of reality. So um, something I saw, uh, something I kind of um, found similar in this was uh, bringing it back to Pandemic Express, um, the remnants could probably be traced back to zombies. Um, that's just a theory, though. Also, in Stalker, whenever they exit their, whenever they exit the room, it's snowing. And in Pandemic, you go to this room, you hit the machine, start snowing, and then you can get out and you know see snow around the map. Um, anyway, I just thought that was really cool and a really neat uh, thing for the devs to do. Um, I thought it was awesome, really. But, um, yeah, I just wanted to share this with the community. And, you know, hopefully um, it leads to people finding more things. Have a good one, guys. I'll see you all later.